Hello everyone and uh, myself Dr. A.K. Saraf uh, from IIT Roorkee and uh, we are going to have a, a course on technical communication for engineers and though the course uh, title is technical communication for engineers but that doesn't mean that it is only for engineers it can also be used by scientists and various kind of researchers. In this course uh, we are going to discuss all aspects related with the technical communications. So we are going to start first of all the importance of technical communication, why it is so important nowadays and how to improve our, ourselves, how to develop these communication skills and not only in the written form but also in the oral form. So if I start with the, the first topic we are going to discuss about the title or topic, how to written how to write a topic or title and all these things how they are written and what should be the focus of the title and other things. Then we discuss about abstract, extended abstract, summary, synopsis and their differences. And then of course the keywords, why keywords are important while searching and other things. So that importance of keywords is also discussed in this course. And then we come to the introduction part. So what, what are the things we should keep in introduction? Then uh, data, methodology, discussion, conclusions, and acknowledgement, and of, of course then uh, how to write references, bibliography, how to give citation for the work which has been done by others which you are using in your. Uh, we will be also discussing how to uh, make a good impactful PowerPoint presentations and what are the content, what should be the font size, what should be the font type and also how to make good presentations and not only preparing PowerPoint presentation but delivery, how to deliver, how to manage time, a given time because most of the time whatever the time it is given, it is reduced by the organizers or chairman. So how to manage within that time and deliver the point which we have thought there are also a lot of discussion about uh, how to prepare nice, impactful figures, accurate figures. So we will be discussing also key elements of figure, maps, uh, drawings, charts, everything. Whether the data can be presented in a uh, tabular form or in figure, why figures should be preferred. All that discussion will also come there. We will be also discussing not only the communication against for a manuscript or a thesis or dissertations uh, or uh, project reports but we will be also very briefly we will be discussing how to make communication technical communication through emails whatsapp and other medium also so all these points what are the mistakes we generally commit how can we avoid these mistakes and uh, then how to write references how to give citation this is very very important aspect nowadays and uh, how one can avoid uh, uh, falling in the uh, category of plagiarism or case of plagiarism, different types of plagiarism and uh, how one can avoid, which are the mistakes when we do, which types of plagiarism or different types of plagiarism are there and what are the, you know, checkers, uh, the internet based softwares. So few types of internet based softwares have also been discussed. Uh, which we can use to check plagiarism before any kind of submission, final submission for a manuscript, thesis, digitation or even a report. And uh, end of the, this uh, course, we will be finally also discussing very briefly about the copyright issue, patent and other things also, which are equally important nowadays because a lot of people are going for incubation, innovation. So how to handle these issues, how to avoid a uh, you know, a case of uh, copying or uh, violation or infringement of copyright acts and other things. So all these uh, things we have, I have included in this course and uh, you know in these 20 lectures of almost half an hour each, I am going to discuss uh, various topics related with overall with technical communication. And uh, as said in the beginning, the title of this course is uh, Technical Communication for Engineers. That doesn't mean only for engineers, for science, scientists, for researchers, all kind of people, those who are doing different kind of technical communication. 
so with this uh, i welcome to this course join us and enjoy and have a good learning about technical communication thank you very much namaskar